Hello everybody, this is Kathy from Kathy's Cards. I did some uh, hauling and shopping today and I got a little bit at, at different places, stores and uh, thrift places. And I wanted to share with you the first thing that I came across. This is by Martha Stewart and I found this at um, Michael's and they were all on sale. Um, I don't know what this thing is normally but I got it for eight something. And I also got blades to go with it and they were only a dollar something. So anyways, I thought, well, I'm going to check this out because it does all kinds of circulars, you know, from uh, 1 to 12 inches. And I thought that would really come in handy. And sometimes if you just want to cut a few out, you don't want to have to get a big machine out or anything. So anyways, um, first of all, on the back here, let's read the instructions and you pull this out. Lift it, and that'll show the blade. So now it should work, hopefully. And then they show that you push down on this thing, and you lift this up, and it'll go as much or as short as you want. So for this here, I'm going to do a smaller one, maybe do like a five and a half, and it locks right in. And then this thing here is like a little rubber thing on it. So I'm going to, just so you can see it, I'll do this kind of in the middle. And all you do is push down on this thing and push down on this while you're cutting and you go around and you can go backwards forwards either way that you want and then voila hopefully oh there you go I mean is that awesome or what and you could do it smaller you know do little ones probably even on top of this here Probably shouldn't push my luck, but we'll give it a try. Push down on this, lift it up, and now we'll go in just for like a smaller one. And we'll kind of go in the middle here. And I'll go back and forth just to show you can do it counterclockwise. You know, whatever you're comfortable with. There we go. So anyways, I'm sure these have been around. I just never saw them. So I was thrilled to get this and then also to do the blades too and when you're done put the little blade thing back on lock it in I took it out of the uh, the container that it was in it had a nice little container but I had to play with it you know this is the paperwork here Martha Stewart and it's got the uh, circle cutter it even shows you the instructions so I'll put that aside here over here so if, you, if you're interested in getting one I guess this is now the time so I don't know if they're just continuing them or what and let's see I got these out I showed you these and then the next thing I did was I also in my shopping there at Michaels I came across these these are buttons and this is a silicone mold for buttons, which I thought would be so cool. Took the little tape off there because, of course, I had to look at them. But look at this. Look at that. Isn't that like awesome? And to get the like colors, um, you can do alcohol inks, or what I think I'm going to do is use, um, you know, watercolor. Um, um, get different colors for that that you can use uh, the watercoloring. Uh, or color food, uh, coloring food, and uh, I'll do that. So I'll let you know how I make out, but I was so glad to get that. And this was like, this was on sale too. I don't remember what the price was, but it was a good deal. And then lastly, <laughs> I picked up these hats. These were at Michael's. Um, if you know, I'm making a lot of different yarn dolls and octopuses and whatever. And some of the people were telling me to try to make a little boy. Well, like I said, I made the um, uh, scarecrow when I made his hat, but I didn't want a scarecrow hat. I wanted this like to make a little boy. So I don't know. These were at Michael's, and to me they were a little pricey, one twenty nine. Um, so I was going to see if I could get them online, but they're really cute, and I'll try to see if I can make one of those into into a little cute little boy. But um, I kind of like my scarecrow right now, so. I don't know. I'm on the border of what I want to do. But these are cute, though. I'm sure I can use them, you know, in other things. 
And let's see here. What's next? What did I get? Then from there, I went to the Dollar Tree store. And I will share with you what I found there. I found these stencils. They might have had these before, but I thought these would be really cool um, for my wood burning or my even for cards. I thought that was really nice. I love the ballerina. And then they had the little dogs and cats and fish. And they got a little parakeet. And this one I really like too, the butterflies. The butterfly one, isn't that nice? And then I thought this one was really cute. Happy birthday wishes. So I got those. And then, I wish they had had more, but they had these little, it's ultra fine glitter, and it's by the Crafter Square, and I got it in this really, I don't know if you can tell, it's a really pretty purple, like a mauve almost. On my screen it looks blue, but it's a mauve, and then this is a red. And it was the last two they had, and I really wish they had had more, because I would have gotten more. And then I was really surprised to see these, because... I've had my one from Stampin' Up, oh God, probably forever. They do, they last forever, but it's gotten pretty, pretty ugly. <laughs> so hopefully these are just as good or close to it. But I found these and I picked up two of those. So I definitely, uh, I, I do like those. When you ever get the little goo when you're making cards and stuff like that, it's the best thing to get off. It's even good on your hands. Then I always pick up um, brushes and stuff. Uh, there too uh, and so I picked up what I really wanted it for was the fine tip one but it had a bigger brush with it but it's got the nice little fine tip so I grabbed that one and then I'm always using their tapes so I grabbed their six pack of tape and then I was pleasantly surprised because I got six of these I haven't seen the prayer boxes in a long time um, so I was thrilled because I still have some from before, but I still enjoy making these and giving these as gifts. So I took, let's see what I, I think I did five of these. So I did five of these. So I was really excited. Uh, nothing else really caught my eye and, uh, I need a little time yet for Halloween. <laughs> I'm not quite into that yet, but, uh, they had a lot of that stuff, but even that was starting to go. But I didn't see anything, you know, different that I really liked or wanted. So, so that was that. That was for Dollar Tree. And then I also, um, this is by mail. This is my Stampin' Up! order that I got from Deb Hoax. And it was uh, towards Donna, um, Donna Jackson. Yeah, her, she's having a party. And I thought this was really cool. It's a bundle. I used to buy Stampin' Up! a lot. But um, I haven't in a while. But look at this. And see the different... Uh, got the bows there, different designs. I thought those were really cool. And in the book, they show them colored. And then you get this wonderful punch. And the punch has the tag. And it has a little uh, piece that goes like here over the uh, over the bows. It's a heavy duty um, punch too. But look at that! Isn't that awesome? So yeah, all you do is stamp it, and then you can punch it out, and you can make really nice bows. I love the sayings that are on them too. These are the clear ones. So I will be happy to uh, work on them. So that was my Stampin' Up. Put that over here. And the other thing I got in the mail was another stamp. This is by Stamping Bella, and I just love their stamps. I think they're so cute. And this one here, it says, um, you see the cute little girls, aren't they adorable? It says, 10 times a hug is all you need to make you feel better. 
which is so appropriate for somebody that's not feeling good or going through a hard time. We all can use a hug. So that came in the mail. And then I got these wings. And this is from AliExpress. I know at first they kind of look like oh foam ones, but they're not. They're glitter, but they're they're like a rubbery. That's like a cloth. And then on this side, it has the glitter. So you can get away with, you know, depending on what you're making. If you just need a plain one, you can use a plain one. But I thought there's so many things you could use to put in the middle here uh, when you're crafting. And they got all different colors. Look at this. They got the gold. Every color you can think of here. So I got two packs of them. Sometimes when you order, you're not sure what they look like. And uh, so I was happy with these. But these uh, these were nice. Put these over here. And then I will share with you. I went to uh, Ambets and Savers. And uh, first thing I got was a lot of yarn. <laughs> Which I'm using a lot of now. These were uh, the Red Heart. I love Red Heart yarn. And I thought, look at that, how nice they go together, the colors. And this was from Savers, and these were $2.99. Of course, I got my discount, so um, they were only think I had, they ended up being like $2. And I got two of these, and you know how much these are in the store. And I love the color. So I got two of these. And then, these are the same color, but again, these are the same price, $2.99. And this is like um, an aqua, an aqua green. I'm so, so excited. And these here, these were older ones. These were $0.99, cents, and these were at Ambets. You can see by the name, too. But look at, um, oh, you probably can't tell, this is a real pretty green. It's a bright green. Which I don't know if you can tell, but it's a, it's a Christmas green. So I grabbed that. We were in this. Then these also. This is a red heart. And this was another one. These were $2.99. These weren't in a bag, though. But they had them tied together. Because this one looks like it had been used a little bit, and not much. And this is a light green. And then lastly, was this real nice, uh, it's like an off-white, it's perfect match, it's a biggie. And that was only 99 cents, and this one was at Ambets. So that was really exciting, finding all this yarn. Um, I did go to Hobby Lobby, and I know this one lady was showing they were 73 cents, but my Hobby Lobby didn't have them on sale for that. So, I left there, and, uh, then I went on to, to the other stores and I made out better there. Okay, this here is, I grabbed this at Sabres. It was $2.99. I really didn't care about anything else. Let me lift this up a little. But look at the stencil. And these are very expensive stencils. So I was so excited. So that's all I see. I said, well, if I can't use anything else, stencil's all I cared about. See, they got, yeah, this is laser cut stencil, nine and a fourth by eight and a fourth. Look at that. Isn't that a nice one? So I was thrilled. <laughs> and the other two things that were in here, which I probably won't use. Oh, it's new. This is string. I might use this or I'll give it to my hubby. Because he has a, he'll use string. And then I got a couple zippers, so I'm not sure if I'll use them. I put them with my other zippers or find somebody that could use them. I was going to do the zippers, but every time I thought about it, I never found anything that I really liked, so I didn't. So I put the other side here. I'm running out of space here. <laughs> and then, lo and behold, I got another cigar box. And it's got a nice little. Lock it there, and then when you open it up, it's real nice inside, nice and clean. Look at that. 
and I have some of the you know the bigger ones and deeper ones but I I do have, after we did a couple of these where they were thinner ones like this I really like them I like them even better so I've been kind of looking out for these a little bit more so I got that and then I had this this was at Ambet's you know, is it 79 cents here but I thought this was cool it's um see it's a Christmas wire but it's very it's like a clear one let's see if I can pull it out here oh, maybe I can't but it's pretty you can see I don't want to take it out now I thought this would be beautiful for Christmas there's so many things you could use this with even my bottles and stuff so that was cool and then I came across this was only 79 cents but look at this little scene isn't that adorable it's got the cat it's got little toys it's got <laughs> little plants and everything so I thought this would be great for a scene so one of the things uh, that I make in my scenes this would be perfect for I thought that was so cute and then these, I guess they're normally at David's for 99 cents. 79 cents. Whoops. <laughs> but I like these, uh, these dogs. These are nice. They're always nice to put in projects. And then they had, this was $1.99. This was at Savers, and it's still sealed. It looks like nobody ever opened it up. So I'm going to open it up and see. I think it's a card thing. I just... I like the, the outside of the box. I'm sorry for the noise, guys. I hate the noise myself. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take scissors. And... Okay, let's see here. says the Lord is my shepherd the Lord is my strength and song look at that oh, let's see what's inside oh my god it's a cup here I thought it was some um, cards look at that oh I love it the Lord is my strength and song oh look at that and there's a bird on the inside the Lord is my strength. Divinity. Oh, I love it. I'll be there. I'll have to show Bob because I was kidding him. I said it's got to be. I thought for sure this had to be um, cards. <laughs> I thought it was cards. I'll see if I can put it back in. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, this. Never get anything back right. <laughs> see, I can't get it back in now. <laughs> Oh my god. All right. Well, I can use the box after I take the cup out. That is really cute. I love that cup. The cup is gorgeous. And then, a few more little things here. Came across this. And this is a set of two doilies. And that was 99 cents white doily and then this is paper doilies they have for 79 cents uh, putting my camera up here and this is a little uh, dotter that you use for when you're uh, lining stuff up and these were little trims I took them out they were loose in the bag and I just put them on these cards uh, they probably had like maybe uh, I'd say maybe four feet in them they were very pretty. So these were kind of loose in the bag. So I just put them on these cards. I didn't put a card on this. I get a card for this one yet. But they were cute. The blues and the... So I got that. Get this out of the way. I love that cup. That is so cool. That cup is so cute. I'm going to put it here. <laughs> and then, lastly, I think, is as we're leaving 
came across. Okay, we are going to put this up even farther so you can see. This is a bag. Look at this bag. It was two forty-eight. And let me see here. Got my stuff all over the place here. Let me try to. There we go. Now you get to see everything. <laughs> I'll move this over just a tad. But yeah, look at this bag. It was two forty-eight, and I saw the little pass. And I saw the little rolling pin. And we're going to open it up and see. I love bag stuff. I just love to see what comes in it. There's the rolling pins. Oh, these would be so cute at Christmas time. I can fix these up. Put little ribbons, paint them. Put them over there. Oh, there's quite a few in here. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Look at these. Oh my my. Oh, this is a bigger hat. I can use that on one of my dowels. Got really tiny ones for miniatures, maybe babies. I get into, look at this. These are all hats. Little baby hats. Oh my lord, look at this. Flower. Little flower. Oh lord. Somebody definitely had this was into the crafting. More of these. Oh my lord. I'm going to have fun. Oh, and in the midst of all this, we got oh, a little Thanksgiving. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, must have been a little pot that you can put something in. One of these little ones looks like they had something in there. I'll have to check it out. That's a little metal thing. Oh, these are candlesticks. Oh, look at this hat. Oh, my goodness. Or these. Oh, look at the little red wagon. <gasps> look at it. Oh, I love it. Oh, that is so cute. It's got the little hay in it. Let's see. And we got more of these. Look at that. Oh, these are going to be so perfect for Christmas. More candlesticks. I knew. Look at this. Oh my. I love these flower things. Well, this is Idaho potatoes on this one. Goodness. Look at the hats. Little baby hats. Uh oh, we have a spider ring. <laughs> I have a girl, a little girl at Laha. When we go over Friday night, um, she made wonderful pictures for my sister Faye. And she loves insects. And she would love this. Anybody else would be afraid. She would love this. So I'll put that aside for her. Oh, we got a couple more of them. Hey guys, let's see, there's hats. I guess I got my money out of this one, huh? Some candlesticks. Oh, cute. Where was this from? Autumn Accents. A little scarecrow. Look at that. Oh, it's be cute. <laughs> and then we got a little basket. A little wicker basket. And put some of these hats in. <laughs> oh, I love this one. Look at that. These are so wrapped. I am going to have. There's more in here. I don't think I can ever get them out. More. These are more. These are more of the candlesticks. Oh, I wish I had a few more of those um, little flower bags. Those are so cute. Yep, the rest in here are more hats and candlesticks. And, oh, this is so cool. Look at these. <laughs> oh my god. I have to figure out what I can do with these little, little hats. I'm sure I'll think of something. 
make miniature, uh, the miniature people. They're all, look at these. I figure out something with the wooden candlesticks. I have to give that some thought. Anyways, oh, this is so awesome. <laughs> Okay, guys, I think that's finally it. <laughs> that last bag, I think, was the best. And the cup, honest to God. I love that cup. I'm so happy about that cup. That is so cool. So I think now, I think I've shared with you. What if, oh, no, there is one more thing. Oh, my God. I don't know if I'm going to have room for it. <laughs> now that I filled this up. Oh, God. Okay, I'm going to give it a try, guys. This was at Michael's. And I'm going to take one out. Before I show it to you, these are only three ninety seven. I couldn't believe the price. You ready for this, guys? Can you see it? These are lanterns. They are. There's six of them. They're only three ninety seven. You can see three ninety seven. Trying to get it so you can. Oh, well, I guess you'll have to take my word for it. There we go. Anyways, you get six of these. And this is what they look like. Look at that. It's got the cute little door on it. And you can open it. Let's see. If I can figure it out. That's a little hookup. Look at that. It's got a little voltage holder in there. If you can see it, maybe. There. So you can put a candle in, or you can put a you know, the electric ones, or you could put a scene in with little lights. I mean, there's so many cute things you can do with this. And it's got a little handle. But anyway, I couldn't believe it. So I got the six. I probably should have gotten another one. They had, well, they had two there, at least at, at mine. But these are just so cute. I just thought they were adorable. So I almost forgot to show you. Oh my goodness. So anyways, guys, I got to clean up this mess. But uh, it was a great day. You know, I really had a good time. I got my little scooter now, so um, I'll be having my knee surgery September 15th. So um, it's really helped me to get around. It's just a secondhand one, and uh, but it's made a big difference. You know, I just get in that. I can just get going. Kick Bab teases me. He has a hard time keeping up with me, <laughs> but it makes me feel good that I can just get around and not have to be pushed or anything. So anyways, guys, uh, I hope everybody's having a you know, great, had a great Friday, and we'll be having a great Saturday. And uh, let me know what you think. I'm sorry if this went on a little longer, but I got stuff from different places, and I just wanted to share it with you because um, I know how much fun I have uh, watching other people's. So anyways, everybody enjoy, and I'll be talking to you real soon. Bye.